Jarvi just shut down. The biggest Instagram marketing software out there just closed its doors, okay? You can see it on the website. They're saying something like, we shut down, we do not accept any new clients. I personally don't know what happens to the existing clients, but it doesn't really matter because Jarvi is officially shut down. That means pretty much the biggest leader in the industry um, of Instagram automation tools shut their doors and now everyone is wondering what to do next. What kind of other software is out there that's like Jarvi or maybe even better than Jarvi at doing what Jarvi did, which is pretty much giving you a solution to automate your Instagram marketing so you end up with getting more real followers, real engagement, stuff like that, right? And automate the thing on a scale, right? So obviously Jarvi shut down and I'm making this little video right here to show you guys some other solutions, right? Because there are many solutions out there and I wanna share that with you guys because there's actually a few tools that are way better than Jarvi that not a lot of people know of. And to be honest, I will show you exactly why Jarvi wasn't even that great in the first place, right? I actually made a video last year uh, comparing Jarvi to another software, uh, which was a cloud-based one. And um, it had so many advantages over Jarvi and stuff like that. Nevertheless, Jarvi was still a big leader in the industry and you gotta give them some respect, but now they're shut down and it's time to move on to something new. So if you're interested in that, if you um, wanted to use Jarvi or if you have been using Jarvi and now you wanna use something else or if you wanted to use it and now it's shut down and you can't use it obviously, right? You uh, should watch this video right now because I'm showing you exactly what to do, what to sign up for and what to get next in order to increase your Instagram marketing, your Instagram presence and get tons of real followers, okay? So with that being said, be sure to watch the video right now. Okay guys, so let's get straight into it right here, okay? So first of all, I wanna let you guys know um, why Jarvi wasn't even the greatest tool in the first place. Like I know um, it was pretty much one of the biggest tools out there, one of the um, like most well-known ones, one of the most famous ones, obviously, right? But that doesn't necessarily mean that it's the best one. Just because something is super famous and everyone is using it doesn't necessarily mean that it's actually the best solution out there, okay? And one reason why that's the case with Jarvi is, is because Jarvi was actually not cloud-based. It was desktop-based, right? And, and for Windows only, right? As far as I'm concerned, right? So you had to sign up on their website and you had to download um, their software and install it on your computer and then you could run it, right? And you would need a virtual server in order to run it 24 seven or else you would have to um, keep your actual computer up all night in order to run it through the night, right? Which was a big downside to it. Plus it was super buggy at times, um, the updates kind of took long and stuff like that, right? So that was one of the biggest cons when it came to Jarvi. The second thing is Jarvi was actually based on the whole follow for follow method, okay, mainly, right? Obviously, it had a lot of different other features and tools and stuff like that, but the main thing, what people did was they added their account there and then they did the whole follow for follow thing, right? Which, which used to be a great method, but obviously, you're gonna run into action blocks by Instagram. Um, there's only a certain limit of people you can follow every single day. So what I'm trying to say is there's huge limits um, to this follow for follow method. And nowadays, pretty much no one is even using it anymore. You know, it's it's kind of like an outdated thing. So that was always the problem that I had with Jarvi and I also explained it back uh, la last year or whatever in my other video that I made where I compared Jarvi to another software that I'm gonna be talking about right now. It's just kind of like old school. It's just kind of like 2012, 2013 kind of stuff, right? Um, what I wanna tell you guys is that the future of Instagram automation, of Instagram marketing actually, is cloud-based. It's all about cloud-based Instagram automation tools, such as Wolf Growth right here. And that's actually the software um, that, I, that I talked about in, the, in my previous video where I compared it to Jarvi, because it was already out there, but it's still a pretty new software. So what they do though, is they do AI-powered organic growth, okay? As it says right here on the website, it's like a smarter way to auto post. You know, they do the, the whole thing where um, you can schedule posts and stuff like that, but that's not the main feature, right? The main feature of this software is the mass story viewing feature, right? So what that means is 
you can go out there and view massive amounts of stories, like literally thousands, tens of thousands of stories every single day of highly targeted users that you can set based on certain targets, right? Based on hashtags, users, followers, people who like certain posts, people who comment on certain posts, right? And you can watch their stories, engage with their stories, like answer quizzes, uh, vote and polls, stuff like that. Um, you can do all of that and they will check you out, right? They will see that you've done that um, and they will go to your profile and um, they will check you out and they might follow you. So it's pretty much like the follow for follow method on steroids, right? Because there's no limits to that, right? You cannot hit an Instagram action block just by viewing and interacting with stories, right? So if you were out there following like 100 people, um, or 200 people in a brand new account, you would get an action block usually, right? But if you view thousands of stories on Instagram every single day using a certain account, it just, nothing will happen, right? So what happens is right here, um, this software is pretty much like it's a cloud-based software. So it's not like Jarby. You do not have to download anything. You do not have to download some file and then install it on your PC. Um, you don't have to do anything. You can just sign up, you get your, log in your password, you just log in, which I will show you right now, log into my account, um, you can log in and then you can just use the software, right? It's as simple as that. So no download, no nothing, right? Now, so what you do is you just sign up uh, for an account, uh, you will get an email with uh, your login details and whatnot, and once you log in right here, um, that's basically what it looks like, right? Uh, this is actually one of my newer accounts right here. Um, so what you can see right here, you have the dashboard and you have all these different uh, icons right here uh, that you can choose from, right? Let's just go to, like when you have a new account, obviously I already added my Instagram account right here, but uh, once you, you guys sign up, you would obviously have to uh, connect your Instagram account first, right? And the way this works is um, you just go here to add account and then you go to uh, connect a new account and then you just simply have to enter your username, your password, um, and select your platform, iOS or Android. And then you have to uh, verify with email, whatever. I mean, you can just add your account and then it's connected, right? And don't worry, obviously, this is not, this is all like cloud-based and whatnot, and it's all 100% secure. These guys are not actually gonna uh, see your password or whatever. It just goes through the Instagram API because it's all connected. So it's only Instagram that actually sees uh, your password, obviously, right? Um, so now they have all of these nice features like schedule posts, um, you know, where you can also schedule reels. I made a video in the past about that, um, so you can check that out. Um, but obviously the main feature is the Mass Story Engager Pro feature, right? And as you can see right here, my account is active right now with like 5,000 uh, reactions per day. I'm kind of like letting it uh, run because it's a new, uh, on, a, on a smaller level because it's like a, a brand new account. Um, not that new, but a few months old. So I don't really want to uh, overdo it too much with this account right here. I'm, I'm probably at around uh, 2,500 followers for this one. Um, but the way this works, guys, is this is actually an account in the luxury travel niche. Um, it's called IG Luxury or whatever. Um, it has 2,500 followers, um, as you can see right here. And the way this works is um, once you connect to your account, uh, what you want to do is you want, just want to go here. And obviously, I already put my settings right here, right? First thing you want to do is you want to check out the uh, safety recommendations, right? It just tells you uh, um, how to connect your Instagram account, um, and it's more safe for you if you have a uh, if you have a connected Facebook business page. I will not go through all this stuff right now, um, but you can check this out once you're signed up. It's really straightforward, and it, it shows you everything. That's also one beautiful thing with this stuff is um, you don't really have to do much yourself, right? You just go on there, and it's all already done for you, pretty much. You just have to punch in your your targets and stuff. That's pretty much all it is. And if you have a question, say have like FAQs and all this kind of stuff, right? So what you wanna do is then you wanna pick your targeting. Um, and what's, what works best for this is usually like hashtags and hashtag likers, okay? Um, so you wanna just uh, type in like a bunch of hashtags. Like, so for example, when you type in your niche right here, for example, travel and whatnot, right? And you put followers, which means the followers of certain users. Um, which obviously means that they are um, interested in what you have to offer. The software actually tells you based on AI and based on certain things um, that it takes into consideration, um, whether or not that target is a good target or a bad target. So for example, this one right here would be a bad target because he only has, he has a certain engagement rate and, and a certain amount of follows and the, the, the engagement rate and the followers number and stuff. 
isn't good, so it's a bad target. And then we have good targets where everything is matching up and stuff like that. So even that, the software does for you. And that's the beautiful thing with AI-based stuff and um, cloud-based stuff versus some old, outdated software that you have to download on your Windows PC. And you just have to do everything yourself, basically, right? Um, Wolf Grove pretty much does all this stuff for you, right? So um, same thing goes for uh, hashtags. When you type in travel, um, it's, it's gonna show you um, certain hashtags, which are the best ones in order, by the way. Um, and it shows you how many public posts there are for each and every hashtag. Um, usually what I recommend is you just um, put in as many hashtags as possible, but you should maybe add like 100 or 150 or whatnot, right? Um, then obviously um, you wanna go down to the uh, story actions, right? And that's the most important part. Right now, I like stories and like story highlights, but usually what you want to do when you start, what you want to start out with is um, you want to do view stories, right? Because that's like the main feature. I just switched it up right now because that's what I'm doing right now for my account. That's what I'm trying out. But usually I run uh, view stories. And the reason why I'm saying I run uh, that right now is because you should not run both at the same time. So do not run view stories and like stories at the same time because it's gonna kind of like mess up with the algorithm and stuff like that. It's not really that great. Um, it's not a great thing to do, right? So what you wanna do is you just wanna run view stories or like stories, right? But obviously start out with view stories. Um, that's really the best thing you can do, right? Now, all the other things, I will not go through that with uh, uh, in this video right now because there's too much going on right here. Um, Wolfgrove actually has, um, they actually have their own YouTube channels. You can just type in Wolfgrove on YouTube and you'll find all the tutorials and stuff like that um, on how that stuff works. Um, but once you've done that, once you click view stories, all you wanna go um, is go down and change your, this is gonna say deactive for you guys, but you wanna click active, you know, click save. Yeah, and once that's done, you're pretty much set. The software is gonna do everything for you. Um, it's gonna go out there and view thousands, tens of thousands of stories every single day for you guys, okay? Based on your targets that you gave Wolf Grove, okay? Um, so yeah, you can also go out there and then you can check the, uh, and then you can check the uh, activity log to see if everything works all right. And then you can check the uh, stats to see how many um, actions you performed every single day. Um, that's just the way it is, okay? So yeah, that's pretty much how it works. That's how Wolf Growth works. Um, be sure to give it a try. We grew a lot of accounts. We grew a lot of Instagram accounts at our agency, Q Social, using wolfgrowth.com, okay? So it's an awesome cloud-based software, so be sure to give it a try. You will not regret it, okay? So um, yeah, that being said, that's pretty much how it works. That's the best Jarvi alternative right now that's out there, that's it's just the way it is. Um, so yeah, be sure to uh, like and subscribe and see you in the next video.